Hi, how are you? Hey everybody, we are here at Blaze Pizza. Oh my gosh, live face-to-face -face ribbon cutting. We are here to celebrate their grand opening and joining the chamber. And we're just excited to be here. Everybody's trying to get lined up right now, so it's kind of crazy getting all this figured out. But we're just gonna have a good time and uh, stay tuned. I think he wants to cut. <laughs> so now you're in Facebook Live. No, I'm Facebook Living. <laughs> Awesome. Another great entity in Relic. Yes, this is great. And they have keto pizza. Are you serious? Six, six net carbs in the pizza. Hey, everybody, the whole look pizza. forward and smile okay. big. Okay, that's fantastic. Yeah. Okay, I have some friends that will like it. All right, we're going to be ready to slice the bad scissors this way. I'm going to count to three. No, no, just back a little bit. No. Right there. All right, on the count to three, and then you're gonna slide, we're gonna set the scissors. Ready? One, two, three. All right, Laura, get them lined up. Inside, in a circle. Councilmember Margolis here, Councilmember Lanning here, Councilmember Cheryl here, John Vick from State Senator Bob Hall's office, Lisa Olson from GISD. Lots of famous people here today. <laughs> me not being one of them. <laughs> you gotta turn the selfie on you there. No, they don't want to see me. Yeah, you have representation from the city, Libby Tucker from Rowlett Economic Development. Hi, right, big circle, big circle. Come on in, big circle. Council member Pam Bell. Hello. Well, hello there. My goodness, good to see you guys. All right, let's 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 get the circle going. We gotta get that going real quick. Yeah, make a big circle, big circle. Get everybody lined up. Oh, no. <laughs> that was wimpy. That was a sad whistle. Do what? He's right there. Yeah. All right. See what's gonna go. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. Come on in. Come on in. John, we're going with you first. All right. All right. Go ahead. Sandra? Okay. All right. Hi, everyone. I'm Sandra Colvin. I am your Rowland Chamber Ambassador Chair. And uh, thank you for attending the ribbon cutting of Blaze Pizza. We're going to ask Mr. John Vick to say a few words. First of all, over to you, John. Okay, thank you. I brought, I brought a certificate, but it's a whole lot Okay, we'll find it. The red folder. I saw it. It's okay. <laughs> so I am here on behalf of Senator Hall, your state senator. Um, just 
happy to be out and about, out, out in the, uh, in the community again, um, and just wish everyone to be safe, and we're excited about this, this new uh, restaurant here, and uh, we definitely look forward to coming and visiting, and um, congratulations. Happy right? okay. All right, thank you. There it is. There it is. Oh, there it is. <laughs> All right. The mystical certificate. It's back. I see a place right over there. Out the window. All right. All right, Sam. Next, we're going to go in a circle and just tell a quick uh, introduce yourself to the group, and we'll start with your staff. Okay. Hi, I'm Marina Petro. I'm one of the owners. I'm going to take this off for a second. Um, I'm on one of the owners, along with Tony and Nathan here. Um, we're just super excited to be part of this community. You've been super welcoming, and you know it just seems like it's going to be a great place for us to be. Um, and we're excited to be employing a lot of people from Rowlett, Garland, and the surrounding areas. Awesome. Fabulous. Thank you. Uh, we've, got, uh, we've got students from, I think, all the, the schools in the area that are just absolutely great. Really excited to have them out here. Hardworking, really great attitudes. And we had a uh, friends and family night last night. We got to meet all their families. It was a really great event. Oh, that's cool. Yeah. Thank you all for coming out. Are these your youngest employees? <laughs> James, James, pizza taster number one. Yep. Uh, pizza taster number two. Awesome. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah, so I'm Nathan Robinette, um, also one of the operator. Uh, just touch on the base edge. Definitely can't say enough about how great the community has been so far. Uh, just from all the employees and all the interactions we've had so far. It's so exciting. We know it's going to be a great fit, and we can't wait to officially open and be serving the best pizza we can. Awesome. Absolutely. All right, so. Oh, so we're going to go around yeah. and introduce Going you. around. Right. My name is Mark Paul. I'm here with the Rowlett Chamber. And, uh, you know, we're glad to have you guys here. Great place to go find you and have pizza. Great fire. Probably one of the best in town, right? Right. All right. Now, but, uh, you know, welcome to the chamber. I need to, you know, give us a call. We'll go back to get that community to come in here. Thank you. You're welcome. Hi, I'm Laura. I'm the membership engagement and experiences director of the Chamber of Commerce. She said a title. I just got my title, James. Um, welcome. And if there's ever anything you need, just let me know. I'm always there. Thank you. All right. Good morning, everyone. I'm Alita Barfield. I'm an ambassador with the Raleigh Chamber. So, welcome. Pam. <laughs> Talk to them. <laughs> Apex Filter, and I'm also a. Let me show you. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, Hi, I'm Sherry Dickey. Um, I'm with a company called Sherry's Visions. I make greeting cards and do events and things like that. Um, James Williams. I'm a financial advisor with Raymond James right on Main Street. I'm also an ambassador. Welcome to the community. Good morning, Whitney Larry, Rowland City Council. Brown and Cheryl, Rowland City Council. Mike Margolis, Rowland City Council. Fred Sweeney, Director of Business for the Police Department. All right. My wife, Patsy. All right, who's next? Lisa Olson, Garland ISD. Thanks for employing our gifts. We appreciate it. Hey! Tony's mom, Marina's mother. You're the real boss. I am. Okay, I know. now Actually, we know. This is the real boss. Oh, okay. This is my mom, Joanne, and we are oh, really proud. That's awesome. That's awesome. Thank you. Hi, I'm Robbie Ryan with Ryan Insurance right down the road. businesses that need to eat lunch and have our employees eat lunch. An alternative to maybe the burger that's uh, that's prevalent or Mexican food. It's pretty good. Uh, but thank you guys. Appreciate you guys, especially Boy and all these people that help us out. Coming out of the... Uh, I'm Jerry Pence. I started the services. I did pest control. I'm glad to have you. Hi, my name's Okay. Tell us a little about your 
process? Yeah. What makes you unique? Come, come down into the middle of the circle so we can all hear you. So we're a similar concept where you go down the line and you can pick your ingredients. We do have eight menu pizzas that you can choose from. You can also customize those however you want, or you can build your own. As many ingredients as you want for the same price. Um, we also have salads and sides. Um, I think our biggest differentiator from a lot of the other pizza chains that you might see around here is that we make our dough fresh in-house. Um, we don't have any artificial preservatives, colors, or ingredients in the entire restaurant. So everything you're seeing here is real food. Um, and we're just really proud of it. And we're really proud to be serving it. So we hope you enjoy it. And we, we think that the ingredients speak for themselves and the taste of the pizza. How long does it take from order to pie? Yes, ideally. And please give us some grace because all of our employees are sure. new. Oh, cool. um, but ideally, the idea is that this is a quick in and out dining pizza place lunch hour, which most pizza places don't really provide that, at least quality pizza places. So you should be able to be in and out or come in and get your pizza within 10 minutes. Very nice. As you can see, there's a lot of different businesses represented in this chamber to network with and build more friendships. And I want to for you the Thank you. Thank you, Kurt. You bet. I did, but I ended up.